As Hurricane Lee approaches, cops crops are yet another concern. Kitty Sharp tells us how one apple orchard is working to prepare. Apples are resilient. They survive stuff like that. But if you break them off at the ground, they don't. Local apple orchards are concerned about the potential effects of Hurricane Lee. The weather this year has already taken many growers by surprise with frosts and heavy rains. Our fruit set was good, but what happened was rain, sun, rain, 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 sun uh, created large fruit, so my trees are a little bit overloaded. The impending storm could knock apples off the trees, ruining them. Although Main Apple Sunday is this Sunday, folks at Hoopers and Monroe are encouraging folks to come pick sooner, and some varieties are discounted. So normally I don't open up this orchard for another week, but uh, we're going to open it up early to try to get some fruit off and unload the trees to probably prevent some damage. They will also have picked apples in the store ready for you to pick up. Hoopers is asking for your help to rescue these apples from the storm and to help them have plenty of good ones for the upcoming fall festivities. You can come get your apples, squash, and a slushie for the ride home. Come pick. Pick, 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 pick. Please help me. We really enjoy it when people come here and the families, uh, you know, and have a good time. So we try to offer activities for kids and go to playground, the corn maze, the apple picking. Uh, meet a lot of nice people from all over the world and uh, just looking forward to seeing everybody this year and uh, we really enjoy it. Katie Sharp, WABI TV5 News, Monroe.